Welcome to the session. I am Asha and I am going to help you with the following question which says Let A, B and C be the Z such that A union B is equal to A union C and A intersection B is equal to A intersection C show that B is equal to C. So first let us learn that if two sets A and B are equal then the number of elements in set A is equal to the number of elements in set B. Also, the number of elements in A union B is equal to the number of elements in set A plus number of elements in set B minus number of elements which are in A intersection B. So, with the help of these two ideas, we are going to solve the above problem. So, this is a key idea. Let us now begin with the solution. And here we are given that A union B is equal to A union C. This implies that number of elements in A union B will be equal to the number of elements in A union C. This is that key idea. Again, number of elements in A union B can be written as number of elements in A plus number of elements in B minus number of elements in A intersection B is further equal to now number of elements in A union C can be written as number of elements in A plus number of elements in C minus number of elements in A intersection C. Now, we are also given that A intersection B is equal to A intersection C. So, by our key idea, this implies that number of elements in A intersection B will be equal to number of elements in A intersection C. And now, by using this statement, it can further be written as number of elements in A plus number of elements in B minus Replacing number of elements in A intersection B by number of elements in A intersection C. And on the right hand side we have number of elements in A plus number of elements in C minus number of elements in A intersection C. And this further implies that number of elements in B is equal to number of elements in C since these two cancels out. Now, let x belongs to A and y belongs to B. Then this implies that x, y belongs to A union B and A union B is equal to A union C. This implies that x, y belongs to a union C, as we can say that X belongs to A and Y belongs to C. From this step, it implies that X belongs to A and Y belongs to C. This implies for all X belonging to A and Y belonging to B, Y belongs to C also. And now from this step and from here, we find that all elements which belong to B belong to C also and also the number of elements in the set B and C are equal. Therefore, combining both of these equations, we find that set B is equal to C. Hence, proved. So, this completes the solution. Hope you enjoyed it. Take care and have a good day.